again, hopefully you're pushing yourself and you actually tried this problem out. Uh, but here we go. The second equation has x equals 2y minus 2. It has x all by itself. So that will be easy to do substitution. So we're going to sub in 2y minus 2 for x in the first equation. So it'll say 2y minus 2 minus y equals 4. Again, all we did was change that x out. Now these parentheses, there's nothing to distribute. You could distribute a 1. So essentially the parentheses are unnecessary. But let's do this. Negative y is negative 1y. That might be helpful, helpful to think of it like that. So if we are combining our like terms now, I have 2y minus 1y. 2y minus 1y is just 1y. y minus 2 equals 4. And hopefully you can see the next step. We have to get rid of minus 2 by adding 2 to both sides, giving us y equals 6. There's one of our coordinates. Remember, we need the x-coordinate as well. So we can substitute into either equation. I would use this second one here. Uh, so it says x equals 2y and y equals 6 minus 2. So 2 times 6 is 12, minus 2 is 10. So writing that as a coordinate then, our x was 10, our y was 6. Let me see what letter that corresponds to on the back here. Just got to grab a sheet myself. 10, 6 corresponds to k. So on the front, on blank number two, put a K. All right, we'll do this one in the next video. We'll do this one together.